Okay guys, I am back with another video. I am going to teach you how to make another inexpensive meal. So I have Farmer John hot dogs or Farmer John wieners. We are going to make roll tacos out of this. So I'm gonna get the corn tortillas, put them in the microwave so they get soft. I have my hot oil. And here I have my hot dogs or Franks, whatever you wanna call it. And you cut them into halves. I remember my mom used to make us roll tacos out of these hot dogs and we so much appreciated her and um, so much appreciated her teaching us how to make them because now I can make them for my children and when my kids would love, my, when my kids were younger, they would prefer the hot dog ones instead of the meat. Can you believe that? So you get one franc and you're going to cut it into fours, okay? and then I got some toothpicks here. We are so spoiled in certain ways if you think about it. And that's why it's important to appreciate with what you have. I love bounty paper towels, but unfortunately they didn't have bounty and I'm not complaining. Another thing too is I um, toilet paper. I like the Scots, they didn't have the Scott brand. I'm using, I don't know what kind of brand, but I'm using the toilet paper. Um, and so that's why it's important to appreciate what we have and use what we have, not having to exceed more than what we need. But I'm gonna show you my pantry. Like I said, I, I didn't show you it in the other video, but I just got done showing you how to make the tacos de papa. So now I'm going to show you another really creative recipe. Super easy, super delicious. So you get the hot dog and all you're going to do is roll the hot dog into the tortilla. And one hot dog is going to be able to make four roll tacos because you're going to cut it into fours. And I don't know if you, you I know that you don't call them hot dogs, but you can call them Franks, I guess. I'm not going to call them wieners, so I'm just going to say Franks. But um, out here in California, the weather has been not so nice. It's been raining for like about four days or so, or just ongoing. And weather like that depresses me. I cannot stand the rain. Yes, we need water, but you don't want to hear about, um, you don't want to, you don't want to hear how I think we should get the water. So here's the roll tacos. I roll them into the corn tortillas. I'm going to put them into the hot, um, pan here and like I said it's a really good inexpensive meal my kids when they were younger they loved it and now my daughter makes it for her kids make sure you use a toothpick to be able to hold the tortilla in place the corn tortilla in place so you cook them into they're nice and crispy so take the toothpicks out of the bowl tacos and then I like to put some lettuce on top and the pico de gallo. The queso fresco or the Mexican cheese. And some sour cream. And the green salsa or red, whatever you like. So let's taste these great taco, these great roll tacos. Oh my God, they're so delicious. And right now while your kids are not at school, you can make a bunch of roll tacos and teach them how to make them. That way when they're hungry, they just serve themselves. They're super easy. The hot dogs are inexpensive. Tortillas, a toothpick, wrap it up, uh, fry them, and just put some really good toppings. And your kids will love these roll tacos. Um, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. So here is my pantry. I bought these Tupperwares over the holidays and I just put like um, flour, sugar, some oatmeal, some beans. I have, this is my little treat bucket, basket. As you can see, I fill it up with candy so when my kids come. This is all teas and vitamins. And then I have all my cans right here. I stocked up on some vegetables and then I have this little tray thing with a bunch of chips. Of course, my kids love hot Cheetos. 
And so I filled it up with a bunch of chips when they want a snack. And then I, at the commissary, the oil was $2 and like 50 cents, that big Crisco oil right there. And then I have all my rice and stuff on this one right here. Um, what else do I have? Um, what else, what else, what else? I have some packets of like gravy and stuff. I stocked up on water here, all my seasonings. So my pantry looks good. It's super stocked for sure. So I think the most important things that everybody needs is beans, rice, and if you don't eat beans at a time like this, and if there's no food, you'll enjoy the beans. So, um, but yeah, I think beans, rice, flour, sugar, cause you can bake. And here's my refrigerator. I stocked it up pretty good, I think. I have some milk here and um, some really pretty tomatoes. I stocked up over here. I put some juices in the freezer. I have um, some meat there and I put all my fish in Tupperware, you know, I put all my fish in storage bags. I have milk and juice and I put some vegetables down in here, some cheese. I have some yogurt, some fresh fruit. I have brown eggs, white eggs, but I have another refrigerator. Here's so let's my see. other refrigerator. Um, Here's all the sauces. We got pickles. I have some more vegetables here. Lettuce and some tortillas and some bread. I have some leftover spaghetti. I have a lot of rice over there. Usually I throw that stuff away, but now I'm gonna really save it because I don't know what the store is gonna have. I have refried beans over there and some bread. And then in the freezer, I stocked it really, really good. I have some hamburger meat here, and then I have um, lots of chicken and ground beef, and I just put it in a, in storage bags. So yeah, this is pretty good. I got that really nice in stock there. So. And here we have Daniel exercising. Um, Gabriel's trying to work on the treadmill, trying to keep us busy because the gym is closed. So he's working on the treadmill. So we can have something to do beautiful weather in california it was raining for four days and then it stopped um and it looks like a storm is trying to come in but uh, i'm just so happy the sun came out for a little bit i was able to do a lot we cleaned the swimming pool and then uh, gabriel is building this fence right here because daisy keeps jumping over i cannot wait for summer the good thing about all the water that came in from the rain as you can see all my flowers are nice and nice and um how would i look at how pretty all the flowers are oh my gosh hi daisy so yeah the pool is super clean